हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल डिस्कस द टॉपिक कॉम्बिनेटोरिक्स कॉम्बिनेटोरिक्स इज द एरिया ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स प्राइमरी कंसर्न विथ स्ट्रिंग्स एन्यूमरेशन परमिटेशन एंड कॉम्बिनेशन व्हाट इज एक्चुअली स्ट्रिंग्स स्ट्रिंग्स सीक्वेंस ऑफ कैरेक्टर्स एन्यूमरेशन मींस काउंटिंग ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट्स परमिटेशन मींस अरेंजमेंट ऑफ सैंपल्स एंड कॉम्बिनेशन मींस सिलेक्शन ऑफ सैंपल्स आउट ऑफ द टोटल सैंपल्स नाउ बेस्ड अपॉन दिस कंसीडर वन एग्जांपल here we have to form the license number plate so question is in a state of maharashtra license number consist of two digits followed by a space followed by two capital letters here condition is the first digit cannot be a zero now question is how many license numbers are possible so in this case there are five letters out of that for the first digit condition is it must it cannot be a zero For the second digit, we have to consider all the digits. That is from zero to nine. Now, for the third letter, space is there, and for the fourth one and fifth one, it is a set of twenty-six capital letter. That is from A to Z. So here, the number of different license number is the string which is equal to first x minus zero multiplied by x. That is its value is ten. Y that is the space value is one. Here Z multiplied by Z is a set of twenty-six capital letter, so its value is twenty-six into twenty-six. So here the answer is sixty thousand eight hundred and forty. Now consider another problem. Here we have to set the password for the website. So here question is: Suppose website allows users to set password with the condition the first character must be a lower case, then second and third letters may be upper or lower case alphabet or decimal digit. For the fourth place, it must be at the rate fifth and sixth are the lower case English letters, star, percent, and hash symbols. And seventh place must be a digit. Now, question is, how many different password can user set? Now, see here. Consider a string of length L. Here, L is represented as lower case letter. U is considered as upper case letter, and for the digits, it is represented as D. Now here, seven letters. Out of that, first letter, it is lower case, so its value is twenty six. Now for the second one, lower case, upper case, and digits. So here, lower case value is twenty six, upper case is twenty six, and digit it is ten. So twenty six plus twenty six fifty two plus ten that is equal to sixty two. Same case for the third letter. Now for the fourth one, only at the rate symbol is there, so its value is one. Now for the fifth and sixth conditions are same, lower case letter and three symbols. So lower case twenty six value, and for the three symbol it is three. So twenty six plus three that is equal to twenty nine. Now last one is seven letter. It consists of digits that is from zero to nine. So its value is ten. So here for the password setting the number of different possibilities are twenty six multiplied by sixty two multiplied by sixty two into one. 29 into 29 into 10. So you will get the final result. So this is your second one. Now third problem. In the third problem, question is a menu card in the restaurant displays four soups, five ice creams, three cold drinks, and five fruit juices. How many different menus can a customer select? If he selects first condition is if he selects one item each from each group without omission. So have to select. one item from each and every group in the second one we have to omit the fruit juices but selects one each from the other groups in the third one he chooses to omit the cold drinks but decides to take fruit juices and one item each from the remaining groups now here for the first condition see the customer can select the soup in four ways ice cream in five ways and cold drinks in three ways and fruit juices in five ways according to the given condition now by the product group the number of ways in which he can select one item from each without omission which is equal to select one out of four select one out of five select one out of three and select one out of five so that you will get 4 into 5 into 3 into 5 how you calculate the combination value if you want to select one out of five in that case your formula is 5 factorial divided by 5 minus 1 factorial into 1 factorial so you will get the answer 5 in this way you can calculate for the 4 you can calculate for the 
you can calculate for the three. So your final answer is four into five into three into five, which is equal to three hundred weights. Now, for the second condition, the customer can select soup in four ways, ice cream in five ways, cold drinks in three ways. You have to omit here fruit juices. So on only exclude this part, you will get the final answer. Select one out of four, select one out of five, and select one out of three, so that you will get. 4 into 5 into 3, which is equal to 60. So therefore, here such selections are 60 ways. Now for the third one, in the third case, customer can select the soup in four ways, ice cream in five ways, fruit juices in five ways, and omit here only the cold drinks. So you have to omit only cold drinks. Again by the product rule, select one out of four, select one out out of five for the ice cream, select one out of five for the fruit juices. So your final answer is. 4 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 5, which is equal to 100. Therefore, such selections are 100 ways. Okay. Thank you, friends.